So my dear friends, what are really the tapping points? Do you know them? Are you hitting the right points? I made this video to explain it to you. So let's start with the first tapping point, which is the side of the hand. I will always use the same word, side of the hand, and we tap on the side of the hand, as you can see. You don't have to pound really hard. You can completely, completely, softly tap on the side of the hand. It's gentle. It's on the side of the pink. Sometimes my clients get confused. What side? You can use both hands. It's okay. You can use left and right, whatever you like, whatever hand you prefer. So the next point is above the eyes. I'm not taking my glasses off. Maybe I should have, but the point is right above the eyebrow. At the beginning of the eyebrow, right above the nose bridge. You can tap with one hand or with two hands, with one finger or two fingers. And when you tap, be gentle. You can tap on the right side or on the left side, whatever you prefer. You don't have to tap in the middle of the head. You don't have to tap all around the, the front of your head, just on those little spots that I just pointed out to you above the eyebrow. The next point is on the side of the eye. It's on the bone on the side of the eye, the bone, the socket of your eye, I guess. You don't go all the way to your temples. That's way too far. It's really just next to your eyes and you follow the corner of your eyes to know exactly where you go. And you tap softly when I say on the side of the eye. The next point is at the bottom of the eye, under the eye, and I will say under the eye. I don't mean close to the eye. I mean really a little bit to the side of the eye actually, and you measure it from the edges of the outside of your eye downwards. So it just is on the side of my glasses and I can tap gently and hit the exact points. This point is really easy right underneath your nose. You will definitely not miss that spot if you use two fingers. Next point is underneath your lips in the indentation above your chin, under the lips. And sometimes I will say under your lips, sometimes I say on the chin. And this point is called the collarbone bone point. But you don't tap on the collarbone, you tap underneath the collarbone. So really feel the indentation underneath your collarbone and tap on that. Once you know what feels like, you don't need to, you know, move your clothes around. You can tap through your clothes. Don't go too low. It's not, you know, it's not on your breasts or near your nipples. It's really absolutely under the collarbone. You can tap any way you like. You can use your fingertips. You can use one hand, you can use two hands, you can use a flat hand. Some people even use a fist. It doesn't matter as long as you tip, tap on that right point. So on the height of the breasts, thank you, my dear sister. On the bra strap, this is how we call it. And for men, we could say on nipple height and you can use both hands or one hand, both hand is not the most comfortable, I can tell you. Then the last point that I do not use a lot is on top of the head. And you can see that you don't need to be at the front or the back, but really on top. And when you tap with a flat hand, softly, gently, don't hurt yourself. That's it. You will be super, super fine. So, yep, thank you, sister. So now you know the tapping points, please use them daily. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.